Welcome back to Level Up Gaming. Today I'm going to show you how to farm the Reapers inside the Skyrest Bridge very early on in the Lords of the Fallen. So make sure you smash that like button, hit that notification bell, and let's get straight into it. First of all, why are you going to want to do this? Well, we can actually farm the Reapers gear straight away early on in this game just by coming to this location and rinsing and repeating this farm. So as you can see, it's quite unique and we can also get the weapons that have an extreme lower chance of getting them compared to the chest and the helmet. So if you guys have already, make sure that you get the Sky Rest Bridge key. And if you haven't, check out my channel. I have posted another video before this to show you exactly how to get here. So first of all, once we get to this entrance, we are going to want to make sure that we are in the undead world. If you guys are, you are going to want to make sure that this door is open. So if you have got the Skyrest Bridge key, you should be able to access this place already. And then we're just going to head down this staircase. And then you are going to see the Reaper just chilling there. The moment you come onto this bridge and enter the middle bit, you are going to see there's a Reaper that wakes up this side. And then one wakes up on this side. So what they are going to do is jump into the little darkness and try and chase you around. You're going to want them to chase you up this staircase and you're going to want them to come inside this area here. So hopefully you guys have got yourself a good range attack and this is the point you want them to stop. So don't try and get them to attack you at the bottom of the staircase. You want to get them actually on the staircase. For some unknown reason at this current moment, you can actually get them to stop there and they don't do anything. They don't try and attack you. They don't try and do anything at all. But if you guys get him to stop at the bottom of the staircase, they will tend to retreat. And this is where it actually makes it so much more difficult to rinse and repeat this farm. So each one that you kill, you end up with around 600 XP and you have a chance of getting something really good from him. So minor uh with a salt and we get the seeds as well so the seeds are something you guys definitely want to get because they obviously give you checkpoints throughout this game and normally the second one will stay on the outside that's completely fine because then you just got to entice him in a little bit get him back onto the staircase and rinse and repeat your ranged attack you can do this so many times and this is a good way to farm xp not a massive amount obviously because there is a lot faster methods but it's a good way indeed and you can also farm their gear i really want to get one of their weapons because at the moment i haven't actually done this uh got one and i have took out quite a few of them but i've got quite a few of the seeds and i've got quite a few of the umbral um vertebrae and all these other type of things that drop so the loot is pretty good but as soon as you guys have done that you are then gonna head back up into this location back into the sky rest and we will be able to rest up and rinse and repeat this process over and over again so make sure that you guys smash that like button you hear that notification bell if you want to see more content like this in the future thanks for watching peace